Before we begin, don't forget to hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications and you'll get 10 years of good luck. Try it, it works. All right, let's begin. Before kickoff, the referee got down on his knees in the middle of the field and proposed to his partner who was the Lions win for the same match. You can see players from both teams cheering them on, leaving behind their rivalry. Players from both teams started pushing it together, the ambulance to get it to start. You could see emotions running high when Liverpool won the Champions League after 14 years. The players did not forget who they owed this success to, their manager. Lucas Moura celebrated scoring a hat-trick with the one person who meant the most to him. What a special moment. He's going to take his first steps on this new pitch as well. It's as well, Jamie. It's lovely, what a moment. Nothing like watching two legendary football players respect each other, unlike their fan bases. We shared the stage 15 years, me and him. I don't know if it's ever happened in football. The same two guys in the same stage all the time. And of course we have a good relationship. We, we not had the dinner together yet, but really? I hope in the future. <laughs> when a little pitch invader rushed onto the field, the French footballer Kylian Mbappe made sure to treat him with an autograph and guided him off the field away from security. The look on Morata's face when he was handed the ball by Ramos, who was the usual penalty taker to take the penalty, says it all about the respect these two players shared. Messi could not help but smile when a Ronaldinho look-alike pitch invader came up to him to show his respect for the football star. Novak Djokovic showed his admiration for the efforts put in by the ball boy who was working hard and providing him with cover from the rain. Sergio Ramos took off his jersey on the spot without hesitation when a little girl came rushing towards him and asked if she could have it. Putting their national rivalries aside, Cristiano Ronaldo came to help Olympic Cavani off the field, earning cheers from the crowd. Wijnaldum and Frankie de Jong showed their stance against racism through this gesture after winning the game. After noticing that his opponent had been injured, this wrestler lent him a helping hand and carried him off. That is the 31-year-old Papau. Papau. Well, look at that. There's a show of respect if you ever needed to see one. Here towards the medics. That's a lovely touch from the gold medalist. After this young fan received a hockey stick from his idol, 
he ended up crying tears of joy from the utter disbelief. An MMA fan with Down syndrome was allowed to intentionally win this match by a professional MMA fighter as a show of respect. After receiving a foul ball, this teenager gave the ball to the smallest and youngest member in the crowd, earning himself instant cheers from the fans. Oh, isn't that nice? Look at everything he's got. An NFL team let a boy with Down syndrome score a touchdown. His mother broke down in tears by the sidelines after witnessing his son living his dream. After accidentally hitting an official on court, this tennis player rushes over to give her a quick kiss on the cheek and apologize. Inter Milan striker Lukaku went to apologize to the fan who he had accidentally hit with the ball earlier during the match. After losing the match, this tennis player was consoled by his son and they left the court together as the crowd cheered them on. When Juan Mata noticed a disabled kid among the fans, he couldn't help but walk up to him and show his support. James Harden especially gave the game ball to an old lady who had celebrated her 100th birthday by coming to see the game that day. Messi called back a young fan after he noticed him crying as he was dragged away by security. Se fue llorando, ahí viene, ¿eh? le va a cumplir el sueño, se va a cumplir el sueño del niño. En lágrimas estalló cuando la gente de seguridad, mira, con las lágrimas en los ojos, pero feliz a partir. Two men selflessly stopped to help a woman struggling.